Welcome back, my home cooks and chef. We got something special on the menu today. You see, we got some crab cakes. So, yes, yes. I'm going to show you how to do my famous crab cakes. If you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe to keep up with my latest dishes weekly. So, see you in the ingredients. All right, so let's get into the ingredients of the crab cakes. These are really simple and easy and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? You need a one third of uh, mayo, one beaten egg. Also, too, you need two tablespoons of either mustard or DJI mustard. It just depends on what you want. Sometimes, sometimes people do spice mustard or spice, spicy mustard. You know, so it's up to you, you know, when it comes down to, down to the mustard. You know, also, too, you know what I'm saying? I have a tablespoon of hot sauce. We got the Louisiana hot sauce, you know, that's my favorite. But you can do Tabasco or whatever you like, Tampico, whatever, you know, you feel like as far as uh, um, hot sauce. Also, too, you can do some uh, salt as well as um, kosher salt, depending on what you want. So I might be gonna, probably going to do a little twist on it. You know, uh, or you can do black cracked pepper. A fresh cracked uh, black pepper. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do uh, lemon pepper, you know, because you know we're always dealing with seafood, so it's good to add a little, you know, lemony taste to it. So I'm gonna do a, a lemon pepper uh, in it, as well as one pound of lump crab, or you can do a, a one a one pound of claw meat. So it just depends on what's your preference. I like claw meat because it's more sweet to me and stuff like that, you know. So it just uh, depends on what's your preference and what you like to do. So make sure when you actually go through the crab meat, make sure you pick out the shells because that's a key ingredient because you don't want to be, you know saying, making your cry, you know, making it and you get to biting on it and get to get crunchy. You want to like, what is this? Like, is this egg? No, you know, some cans, you know what I'm saying, they don't really kind of sift out a lot of the shells. So make sure that's a key ingredient is sift out your crab meat and stuff like that so you make sure you can have a smooth because you don't want to be having guests over and, and they be crunching or something like what's this i broke a tooth so i'm just saying you know so um let's get into assembling this i'm about to go whip this up and everything in a bowl so let's go over there and um uh, get this uh, uh cracking so we're gonna get ready to make the uh, crab cakes pretty simple and stuff like that i'm gonna add the mayo in first so just add your mayo in um, add your eggs, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you scramble up your one egg before you put it in there because you be, you know what I'm saying, chasing around your egg and stuff like that. Add your mustard in and your W sauce, something like that. So let me uh, mix this up together, put all these ingredients, you know, kind of look like tuna, but it's not. <laughs> More of an expensive to it, <laughs> yeah, that. but um, I am going to be doing a video. Um, I'm going to do a video on um, a salmon cake as well coming up next. I mean, so look out for that video. If you're new to your channel, don't forget to subscribe. I really appreciate all you guys' support. And do me a favor, leave a comment in the um, you know uh, uh, in below what you think about the recipe and if you have any other recipes that you have in mind that um, you would like me to try out. Uh, I'm about to get ready to add the panko bread breadcrumbs in. This is what actually sews it all together. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I always, you know, something I always have. So, mix in your breadcrumbs. You know, next. And this will actually bring it all together. And uh, after I finish stirring this together, I'll, you know, put the, we'll get ready to uh, fry them up. The crab cakes, finish them up. All right, you guys. All right, so we're getting ready to uh, fry up these crab cakes. What I normally use is, you know, ice cream scoop if you have them. If you don't have them, just, you know what I'm saying, roll it into a ball and stuff like that. This actually helps come out perfectly and stuff like that. So, you know. And don't pile up, Miana, don't pile up your uh, your skillet with them and stuff like that. Make sure you spread them out, you know, evenly around and stuff like that. Each one, you know, um, you wanna make sure you have enough around. So I'll put three in, I think that'll be good enough. 
So, pat them down. They can shake them up. You see how they become kind of round. And uh, just let them cook. You know, my you, it's already done. So all you want to do is uh, get a good color, you know, both sides, on all sides of them and stuff like that. And um, you can put your uh, heat on uh, probably medium heat, 375 degrees, depending on, you know what I'm saying, your oven. If, if you got, you know, uh, um, if you have an electrical oven, you know, just put it on uh, medium high. I got it on medium high right now. You know, and, uh, and then we're gonna be flipping them. But they look, look pretty good. Shoot, I wish I had smell a bit. It smells pretty good. And stuff like that. So, yeah, you know. All right, so I just flipped them. So you can let it uh, fry on each side for about a good minute, minute and a half or something like that, you know, to get a good coloring and stuff. Like, it just depends on, like I said, you know, your uh, eye and your oven, you know, but this is how it's supposed to look. You know, we're gonna be finishing it up. You know. But you know, press it down. You don't have to press it down too much. You know what I'm saying? To make sure, you know what I'm saying, it's cooking through. But um, after, you know, we finish here, we're gonna be done. I really hope you enjoyed this recipe. If you don't forget to leave a comment below. Let me know if you tried this recipe out or if you ever tried it out or if you got a different recipe that you maybe want me to try out regarding crab cakes. But I really appreciate you guys coming through. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. See you guys in the next dish.